Here we go, baby. Hi, Mel Mel. Hi, baby. Say hi to the camera. Say hi, Mel Mel. Hi. Remember when Mel Mel saved us from the bad man that walked in? You're such a good girl, baby. Yes, you are. Your bestest girl ever. We're gonna be going through the clothes today, Millie. I got, you gotta get out of the room. I don't have a door anymore, but you know why that is. Oh, man. Open it. Go to sleep. Okay, baby? Come on. Yer, 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 what's going on, baby? Welcome back to the channel, guys. If you don't know who I am, my name is Jake Duffner. Every day is an absolute banger. So if you're new to the channel, do yourself a favor and hit that subscribe button. Yo, I haven't done an intro like that in a very long time. I feel like all my videos are extremely, extremely serious, and sorry to say it, but this one's gonna be probably the most serious video that I have done in a very long time. In the sense that, you know, it means a lot. It means a lot. As you guys know, I got a bag of female clothing behind me. There's a lot that I didn't go through only because I was trying, I'm on my computer right now, I have my mouse here. I don't know why I can't figure out how to set my camera up to see like the computer. I mean, I don't know, I'm not, a, I'm not like a streamer or anything, so I don't know how to work this, but I have my computer here and I'm over here trying to search up missing peoples and I'm trying to match the clothing behind me with people that are on the internet missing in my New Jersey area. After about five, 10 minutes of doing it, I realized very, very quick that this is literally impossible to do. I'm not an FBI agent, you know, I'm pretty smart, but you know, I would go FBI smart. So I'm sitting here and I'm like, this is gonna take way too long. And even if I did find a shirt that's similar to a shirt that's on there, I'm not gonna be able to see via the internet if it is the exact same shirt if you know what i'm saying so i figured it was kind of like almost a waste of time to start doing that so instead what i'm going to do is i found literally so many articles of missing people so many articles of missing missing people i really wish i could make a whole video dedicated to all of the kids that are missing in the entire world and i know there is a lot a lot of unfortunate events that happen to kids around the world but as of right now we're focused on around the new jersey area just for the sake of the video obviously we're all gonna pray that kids all over the world will have justice but from where i am there is just a lot a lot of stuff going on and i want to bring light to it you know i want to bring a lot of light to it i did notice somebody in the comments yo you guys think i'm FBI agent status, bro. The Duffies are what's FBI status, okay? I go through the comments, I read the comments. Some wise young Duffy let me know that one of the shirts that are in here, I, I, I don't remember which one. Aha, I found it, I do remember which one. This shirt here is actually not a little girl shirt. It's the first one I picked out in the last video. It looks like a little girl clothes, it's tiny. No, this is like a little girl, like little ooh 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 thing. It's because it looks so very tiny. It, look, it barely fits over my bicep because I'm just so manly and strong. I guess she paused the video, zoomed in, and saw that it says... Victoria Secret on it. This one actually does... Maybe it wasn't this one. Hold on. I'm freaking out now. Is it this one? I think it might be this one. Yeah, this one says... Vic no, this one says Forever 21 now. Ah! See, this is why I'm not an FBI agent. You guys in the comments, the Duffies, the family, we the FBI together. This one doesn't say Victoria's Secret either. Honestly, Forever 21 might not be a children's clothing company either. Not sure 100%, so let me just let me just look a little bit more. 2,000 years later. I think it's this one. No, this one's also Forever 21. Uh, maybe, maybe the comment said Forever 21. I'm not sure. I'll have to go back and check at it, but whatever the case may be, the clothing that's in there, one of the brands or some sort of crazy thing that my fans were able to figure out said that the brand does not actually make little kid clothing. It only makes like adult like female clothing. So that blew my mind, first of all. It's just great to know new things here and there. So that got me thinking, yo, this Calvin guy, is it not just like infants that he's taking? I don't know.
it goes back to what I was saying before. I don't want to make any crazy accusations because I just simply don't know. I'm in the dark just as much as you guys. I'm documenting every way for you guys. Like we're, we're almost in this together at this point. So I know a lot of people are asking me questions in the comments and I just simply don't know how to answer them. I'm sorry. <laughs> But I said last video, maybe this family, the McGinley's family, is actually raising the ch a lot of the children. It might not be like he just takes a little kid, kills him, eats him, calls it a day. For some of them, he might take and actually raise them. Maybe he takes them as like a little kid. But as the clothing states, it doesn't make sense for a little kid to be wearing Forever 21 or, or Victoria's Secret. So does the kid grow up? Is the kid in a closet? Is he just stripped from his entire livelihood and life? and grow up with a serial killer? These are just questions that I don't know. It's just me throwing them up in the air and trying to figure this out as I go. But anyways, long story short guys, this has no intent to say that any of these missing people that I'm gonna show now have anything to do with anything. I simply just want to spread awareness. If you guys do know anything with the I, I beg that you watch every second of what's about to come up and you really look at the people that you see if you have any information any like i mean like just any little information please contact the new jersey police department i am not accusing anything to be involved with the mcginley's it's just all in general at this point i want to bring awareness to all of the missing children across you know we have a huge fan base we have almost half over half a million Duffies at this point. And I wanna use it for as much good as possible. You know, we stand for Save the Children, hashtag Save the Children Gang. And I wanna bring awareness to not only the McGinleys that are monsters, but you know, just let everybody know that the world is a scary place and you never know what's going to happen. So stay safe, first of all. And second of all, please take a moment to look through these missing people with me. And if you do have any information, contact New Jersey Police Department. And I'm gonna make a deal with you, okay? Listen, listen, I, I'm, I'm just, an, I'm just, you know, I'm, I'm feeling it tonight. It's, it's like 3 a.m. right now. I'm feeling it, and I just want to make a deal with the Duffies. Hold on, one second. I got a whole red ball, baby. Boom, baby. I'm gonna crank one of these bad boys and let you guys know that if anybody has any legitimate information about the kids you're about to see, if you contact the New Jersey Police Department, I will personally give you $500 reward just for any information about any of the people you're about to see. That is a deal, a solid deal for you guys, but it has to be legitimate. If I find out, first of all, that you are lying about that and you call the state police for no reason just because you want a free $500, first of all, I'm almost positive that that's tampering with evidence and you're probably gonna go to jail so I advise you not to do that and two I will be extremely disappointed in you like to no end if you do have legitimate info contact the New Jersey police let me know $500 reward for anybody any one of the Duffies yo we're in this together we're saving the children hashtag save the children also if you don't have any information at all you can still help out by going to the first link in the description, DuffinBrand.com. All the Save the Children merch, that's where the rewards are going to be coming from. And the whole point of the Save the Children merch for these holidays and for the days to come is to one, spread awareness around the world for all the children. Hashtag Save the Children. And two, just to kind of make an impact and do as much as we possibly can. So you can put more money into the pool for more rewards and hopefully find out more investigations and have more investigations about these kids around not only New Jersey, but the entire America and world. <laughs>